in our culture, or at least when I was growing up, they had wichoyake. Those are the word we use for accounts of the people. Now these are supposed to be based on fact. Wichoyake. They tell about something that happened. And then ohunkaka. Those are like, uh, like Grimm's fairy tales. You know, the animals are talking, the animals are, are, are doing something. And then we have like unktomi. We have, we tell a lot of unktomi, they tell a lot of unktomi stories. There's oyaka bektade unktomi he unkia pekel. Unktomi was us, before the people, before they became people like people. We chasha kachya, umpi, they say. You know, you live like a civilized human being. We chasha kachya, umpi. But he was, before that, hechaon ktomi ata washi chunchishni. Ktomi didn't want to work. Tukhtena uh, Tishni, he had no home. And oh, he had no chino money. He's always going around hungry. I could say, Doachi, I got chin there. Doachi, why not Doachi? Anyway, he was always hungry. Then he had really beat up clothes all the time because he wasn't civilized and didn't understand he was supposed to try to work and try to do what's right. It's kind of like, oh, he really, really exaggerated. That, that's a common word that we use, that we use. I'm not common, but you know, Somebody does something really good. Maneni kidi, you tell them. That's the other thing that the women say. Somebody does something. Ma, they say, you know. So you start practicing using those words so you can really, really, really be with it. But anyway, kidi, uh, you know, you're really something special, really, really great. Uh, so anyway, that, that, that's the word we use. Um, but anyway, Unkto was us, Unktomi was us before, uh, you know, he wasn't civilized, so he didn't understand a lot of stuff. That's And you know, he really fooled, uh, fooled people. He would make up preposterous stories and tell it, and they, people would believe it. Mahe Unktomi, let's say somebody that is a big pretender, pretends to, oh, he's just flattering you. Well, then he's being an octomi, or she's being an octomi. So we have to be careful of that, too. They always taught us that when we were growing up. Careful. Hey, nignaynkta. Gnaya. Nignaynkta. They'll say, they'll fool you, you know. And I think that uh, that our poor young people today, you know, they're just tied to English. So they don't know when somebody comes to them maybe with meth and says, oh, you try this, this is really good, you know, and that's, that, that's, that's what Ganaya means, they're fooling them, that, that's good for them.